Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to do something really simple. I'm running late in the day for my video and I wanted something easy, so I thought, well, you wanna know what? Let's cover five or six YouTube Linux channels that everybody should, should subscribe to. So chances are if you've watched this video, you're probably already subscribed to these, but you never know. So I just thought I would do something easy today and go through and talk about this. So let's just go ahead and go through these, shall we? So the first one I want to cover is uh, Hex DSL. So uh, he has about 10,000, he's very close to 10,000 subscribers, but he doesn't get very many vi views on his videos because he does Linux gaming. That's pretty much all he does. Every once in a while he'll cover a general Linux topic. He's awesome. I mean, he's funny as hell. Uh, he does swear on his channel. So if you're, you know, family friendly, you may not want to watch watch him, but I think he's very funny. Uh, covers a lot of Linux topics, big Linux guy. Uh, you should definitely subscribe. I'll put all the links to these channels in the video description. The second one is Brody Robinson. I believe he's Australian. Uh, Hex DSL, I believe he's British. Brody does a lot of more uh, niche, nerdy stuff in terms of Linux. He doesn't cover do distro reviews or anything like that. He covers window managers and terminal applications and stuff. So if you're a, a big terminal guy, Brody Robinson's definitely somebody you want to subscribe to. He publishes uh, videos every day. Hex DSL publishes maybe four times a week or so. And sometimes he has somebody else do videos on his channel, so which is a little weird. The next one is Mental Outlaw. So uh, he, this guy is pretty popular, uh, almost 70,000 subscribers. And he doesn't only do Linux. He does a lot of um, more l Libre kind of stuff focusing on free and open source political things. Uh, he does do some distro reviews. Like today he did Pop! OS. He also does some things with window managers and he specifically usually DWM. Uh, but he fo and also does things like th on cryptocurrency and uh, privacy and stuff like that. So he's more broad than the other channels on here. Uh, the next one that you might not know about is actually Linux Dabbler. Now, uh, he doesn't publish videos very often. He's just over a thousand subscribers. And he focuses specifically on Debian-based systems. So if you're a Debian guy or even Ubuntu, uh, and you're not really into the whole general Linux distribution review kind of thing, he does a lot of stuff, like I said, with around Debian. He also focuses on DWM, which is a very interesting combination because a lot of people who use Debian, you know, they don't usually use window managers, or at least, you know, f as far as I know. Um, anyways, very well spoken, publishes maybe once or twice a month or so. Not very often, but all of his videos are fantastic. The last one is, of course, DistroTube. I think everybody probably subscribes to DistroTube. Interestingly enough, DistroTube just subscribed to this channel, so happy days. Uh, it's kind of what gave me the, the um, idea of doing this video. Uh, that and a couple of the other ones have just, you know, just kind of shouted out other Linux YouTube video channels. So everybody knows DistroTube if you, you really haven't, you know, every once, he, he does almost purely Linux content. Every once in a while, he'll have some weird political thing that he sh throws out on his channel, his channel, whatever. Um, but mostly you'll get a lot of window manager stuff from him, distro reviews, uh, and stuff like that. He's out of all of them. He's the biggest in terms of subscribers. He's just went over a hundred thousand. So I have one more to cover. And that one is of course the Linux cast. So if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button. I do Linux content seven days a week. Uh, some of it's very niche, so I do a lot of uh, window manager stuff, command line stuff, and stuff like that. We also do a podcast once a week. It's on the same channel. That's what the channel is actually named after. This was supposed to be the channel that we just put the podcast on. And I just decided, you want to, I'm just going to throw it all here. We'll build it up the channel. It's going to be good. Uh, so, yeah, subscribe to us. So subscribe to all of these. Seriously, it's not as if you can only subscribe to one. That'd be silly. So, Subscribe. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. Now, here's what I'm really interested in. Do you have any Linux YouTube channels that I didn't mention here that are really good? Because I'm always looking for good uh, YouTubers to follow because, I mean, really, seriously, we all steal ideas from each other. I mean, I, the one I didn't mention actually was Luke Smith, which is probably uh, an omission somebody would, would question. I didn't cover him because he's very polarizing a lot of his videos are very political 
uh, and weird. Um, he also does very niche stuff. So he'll talk about, you know, and uh, obviously he does window management and stuff, but some of the stuff is very niche. So I just didn't put him on the list, but you should definitely subscribe because some of the time, some of the times his stuff is really good. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Make sure you subscribe.